muore. It is you and me, Beyonce. I want to know just what you know about hair. I have never purchased into a celebrity brand. Then comes Beyonce, right? Performer, inspirer, entrepreneur, businesswoman, singer, vocalist, lyricist, and now, and owner of Sacred. Listen, when I uh, saw that Beyonce teased still during her Renaissance tour, when she was releasing a hairline, I was uh, quaking because this woman I hold on a pedestal. Or when it came to her launching a brand, I was like, this is a very interesting because her hair care experience has never been one that I would have looked up to from that point of view. That being said, spent my own money, all of her brand, all of her products, every single product on her website I bought. If you're wondering about my hair, don't. <laughs> I was testing something, I like it. I am wearing a wig and I've been wearing this for four days, meaning it is crusty, it is dusty, it is full of product, full of waxy, jelly, foamy, moussey products, also full of air pollution, dust pollution, sun exposure, wind exposure. Basically, this thing has gone through it. So the first thing I need to do is actually remove it because my hair underneath is so dirty, which is literally why I was saving these products for this day because allegedly her products are extremely cleansing. We're gonna see about that. I don't wanna cause any hype or say anything about where this wig is from or who is releasing it this month. <laughs> I said too much, I said too much. Anyways, I need to remove it because it's been on for four days and this is, this thing is glued. All right, let's remove this wig. Better. Now here's one thing I did not consider. Normally I do this step in the shower and I tend not to care how I look. In this case, however, I am presenting to you products that ideally I should have done when I looked better than this. But you know what? You're getting raw, you're getting honest, you're getting... Oh, you come to visit. This is salami. Sacred. This is Beyonce's line. In case you didn't know, she released a hairline. She called it sacred. I like it. It's a play on her word. It's also on the play on the word of the word sacred because she believes that hair is sacred. Rightfully so. Same belief system as me. Here are two things I already don't like about the brand before even ever trying the brand. Number one, one of the reasons I love Beyonce is because she genuinely does not shy away from maximalism, color, bold, beautiful, weird looks. Beyonce is known for them. She will pick the weirdest look ever. Not seeing it as much here. If I didn't know that this was Beyonce's hairline, I would not assume that it had any relation to her. It is giving skims extremely. The only thing that I'm kind of intrigued about by this packaging is that they managed to replicate kind of this like stone <coughs> texture. Second thing, because I am a super fan of Beyonce, I ended up buying the Super Fan Bundle, which is a collection of every single product ever released. I figured this is a really, really great way to judge the brand as a whole because you get to see how every single product plays in your routine, especially as a hairstylist if you have multiple needs. This cost me 246 euros, just the bundle alone. One thing I was not expecting to pay was a 116 euro additional shipping and delivery fee that was added onto my order, bringing the total up to 366 euros. In comparison, something like Skims, when I ordered a box this size of a much lower order value, the shipping was entirely covered by Skims, including returns. Anyways, Let's get into the products. So one of the reasons I was actually super excited to actually try this, and here's where the benefits start to come in, is that although this is obviously 
carried by Beyonce's power, name, and presence, Beyonce is not a stylist. Many people are theorizing that this brand is actually her mother's work, who was a stylist for many, many, many years, put into a brand, as well as Beyonce's personal stylist, Neil Farina. Our products honor the love and connection of hair traditions while delivering what your hair craves. We don't dress hair with cosmetic sheen, we fortify your hair with rich conditioners, transformative proteins, fermentation, and patent pending technology to create sensorial luxury and exceptional performance that makes your hair look as healthy as it is strong. And I think part of the reason why they chose this packaging that I decidedly shit on is that they wanted to show that this brand doesn't come with all the decoration, accessorizing. From just unboxing the products, I can immediately tell that the products do not smell the way that typical products do in the sense that they are not very heavily fragrant at all. And they smell very, very almost clinical, but more minty. Try it. Starting with the clarifying shampoo and salt, salt scrub. I Clarifying shampoo and scalp scrub. Seeing as my hair is still super crunchy with all the product in it, I am excited to see if this works. It's got little beads that help remove and lift product. And I want to make one thing uh, like a tiny bit clear because I don't know if it was reiterated well. When washing your hair, you're not washing your hair, kind of. You're washing your scalp. This isn't gonna get you as far as this is gonna get you. I cannot tell you how nice that feels. I don't know if it's the product or if it's the fact that I'm finally washing my hair. First thoughts on this product. I remember now why this is not the part of filming that I like. Hydrating shampoo. Whenever you use a cleansing shampoo, you always need to use a hydrating shampoo that is going to replenish some of the oils. It's going to provide a gentler cleanse. Otherwise, you have a tendency of drying out your hair and your scalp a bit. Ooh. Ooh. It's leathered up so quickly. That is so nice. Oh, I like this product so much. Rinsing again. You can see that it's finally lifting the blue staining that I had massively on my scalp. One of the things that I genuinely haven't heard anything about on the internet is this product. What is it? Well, my dear friends, it is fermented rice and rose protein. Uh, it's a two-part mixture that you dilute and mix up in this bottle right here. Apply it all over your hair. These two, I think I want to give their own video for. I'm actually extremely excited to try their masks. I think today I just want to try the moisturizing deep conditioner. Smells of nothing. Again, if you like things that don't have strong scents or don't have very perfumed scents, this is perfect for you because it it has nothing. Ooh. That was buttery smooth. If you'll excuse me, I need to treat myself. <laughs> because I am getting way too into this, so... I'm gonna say this much, the products clean. They cleanse very, very, very effectively. Moisture sealing lotion up next, followed by the thing that I'm most excited to try, the beehive oil. Now, I don't know how you guys apply your oils. 
but I like to apply mine on wet hair and on dry hair. My hair is very dry, obviously. I do things to it. It's not dying because hair is already dead. It's not going to fall off. It's not in its hay face, but it's it's been through some shit. So I like to lock up, lock up. What's the word I'm looking for? Bulk up on my oil. Guys, my social battery ran out. It's 9.30 p.m. and I, I don't know what to say anymore. Just listen to this. <laughs> giving myself politician well that was a workout um i have very mixed thoughts on one hand my hair feels so thick like just thick that i've, I've never felt this amount of hair on me ever but then it is also bringing me to the point that I don't like is, is that I think my hair is extremely coated. That was one of the things that I've heard in all of the reviews and feedback that other creators and stylists have said is that these products are very, very heavy. You can even see in its movement that like it feels stilted, like it doesn't feel like a fresh blowout. It feels like it's days old and coated with hairspray. I do like the products because I do think that they deliver in every single aspect that they say. It does feel cleansing, it does feel hydrating, it does feel deeply conditioning. I don't believe that it's good for all hair types, which is one thing that they have been advertised as. If you have fine hair, thin hair, silky hair, medium to fine, if you have thick hair but very, very not porous, every single one of these products is just, it's gonna feel too heavy, it's gonna coat your hair and it's going to feel weighed down. I think these products were fundamentally designed for curlier textured hair that is lacking in moisture because it is delivering every single aspect of that. So that's my thoughts. Uh, the volume that this gave, as you could see, without using any volume products, what it... I think it's also, it would be so good if you're, like if it's your wedding day or you're doing a particular style because this feels like it prepped my hair like crazy. Like I could do like acrobatics in this hair. <sighs> Thank you, Beyonce, this was fun. Okay, well, I wanna link all the products used to the description box below in the event that you want to take my two cents and run with it. I would also highly urge you to get excited because something's launching this month and I think you're gonna love it. And I will try to cater for it, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you give it a go and I will see you in my next video. Toodaloo, bitches. What is this hair color? I, I don't know. 
I don't, I couldn't tell you. I could, what is this? 